Gentlemen, it's good to see you again. Nice Larry. to see you, Larry. See nice you. to see you, Larry. Lovely. Uh, what is Apple, John? It's a, it's a company we're setting up which involves records, films, electronics, which make records and films work. And uh, what's it called? Manufacturing? Or yeah, it does a few things. You know, you know the byproducts that end up with Larry Page uh, t shirts and that. It's oh. just trying to mix business with enjoyment. Pleasure. I see. We're in business, you know. We find ourselves in business. Are you, the directors? Trying to make it, Are you the directors yeah. of this? Yeah. But, yeah. like, all the profits won't go into our pockets, they'll go to help people, but not like a charity. What do you plan? Somebody how it wants works. to make a film and no. They go to a company and they get shown into the waste paper bin <laughs> and uh, nothing ever happens. So they go around, they make an underground one and it goes round and round underground and a lot of people never see it. I see. So if they come to us, they won't stand a chance. <laughs> but we hope to make a thing that's free where people can just come and do and record and not have to ask, could we have another microphone in the studio because we haven't had a hit yet. I see. How expansive, how large will this be here? Oh, well, like that. <laughs> How large will it be in America? We don't know yet. You know, it'll be big, I think. We're just blowing up the balloon. There's lots of things. You know, we just got a friend of ours who's in electronics. Oh, yeah. I'll tell you about this chap, who's called Alex. And he's great. He's a Greek fella. And he's Even invented... He's Greek. He's invented really incredible nice. things, you see. So, uh, that'll be big. Well, are, the <laughs> days of the, are the days of the Beatles on stage uh, over? Uh, well, they've been over for the last two years because we've been on land. But uh, you never know, do you? With all these incredible electronics, we might come flying over New York, playing one day. Do you? Uh, did you enjoy the trip over to India? Yes. Lovely. The journey was terrible, but the trip was all right. Yeah. There was a report that uh, now we we get yeah, very bad true. reports. Yeah, Smashed him. <laughs> <laughs> that you didn't uh, you didn't like it or you didn't have the patience and you decided to go home. We were there trip. four months, or George and I were. No, it we was lost cool. thirteen pounds and we looked a day older. Did you, uh, do you think this man's on the level? I don't know what yeah. level he's on, but uh, <laughs> he's on the we level. had a nice holiday in India and came back rested to play businessman. What do you see in the years ahead uh, for oh, yourself? Oh, you know, an expanding vista. Apple, you know, sign set it up and then see where it goes. It's like a top, and we set it going and hope for the best. Uh, yeah. Paul, about a year and a half ago, and there were quotes on the wire about uh, oh, right. your discussion of LSD and uh, some other things, <gasps> narcotics. Yes, uh, Larry. It seemed to me, from what I read, that you had endorsed it and uh, condemned we it. We were manufacturing it. What's the story? Time. No, the, the business the, went bump. <laughs> 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 uh, uh, somebody asked me, uh, some newspaper man came up and he said, uh, have you had LSD? So I thought, well, I'll either be cagey here or I'll be honest. So I said, yes. And it was his responsibility <laughs> for reporting it. So they had him on TV saying, why did you say this? Why did you say Almost this? Almost like that situation. Yeah, but they kept that. asking him, did you take it? So he says, yeah. But on TV he says, well, you don't print this bit of film, man. I mean, I don't want to tell anybody about Almost it. Almost like private. the situation right. with the Christ statement. Yeah, right. But see, they just asked me a question. I gave him an answer. And then uh, it was blown up. I mean, you know, I just spoke the truth. And it's sometimes painful. You know, here in the United States, we've had a lot of uh, riots on campuses in the you last... You betcha, Larry. Uh, do you read much about these things? Yeah, it's on the news all You know, the these same we people were... We've got TV back home now. <laughs> you have? <laughs> yes. We've seen them. These same people were Beatle people four years ago. Yes, and, yes. Uh, They've grown up, eh? What, what's your immediate uh, reaction when you read about something like this? It's happening overseas now, too. It's going Carson. on everywhere, you see, so the immediate reaction it's a is... Drag. wonder what... The main object of all this going on at once is... Mm. And then it makes you think, Larry. Yeah, you Even know, in Wales, they're be, rioting. People seem to be, uh, like, unhappy about something. And they seem to be messing it up. So that anything we can do to help, we should do. And so that's what everybody's that's doing. What, that's what Apple's about, you know. Trying to make people happy. No, Not really, you know, just trying to help, you know. They don't have to be happy. <laughs> You know, just trying to help people. I'm very slow. You get the picture, Larry. Come on, own up. Own up, Larry. <laughs> Are you happy? It used to be nice, Larry. Are used to happy? be very charming. Yeah, I'm not completely happy. I'd be a fool to say I was, Larry. It or varies, doesn't it? I mean, I mean, generally. if you had it all yeah, the time, generally, yeah. it might be hysterical, but... Do you miss the big crowds? I mean, the big, big crowds? And the... No, I don't miss them at all, Larry. 
It's all past now. Well, we don't know. Five looks quite big to me these days. When my eyes are going. Twenty-seven, you know. How uh, how is Ringo and how is George? Lovely, very healthy. Mm -hmm. Do you uh, plan a uh, any type of theatrical production? Uh, I don't theatrical. know. If somebody theatrical. comes up with a theatrical production and says I can't get this on, we say, can't you? Let's have a see look. What do you think about? We know ourselves doing it yourselves. Oh, on stage. They're doing one of John's books at the National Theatre in London. Mm. It's disgusting what happens in England <laughs> these days. What about? Uh, well, I hate to, I hate to get on politics. And all all right. We're still doing all that, you know. Nothing's changed. The only difference is we don't tour, but uh, we might do in the future, you know. You might tour again. Yeah, we only stopped touring because it there was nowhere to go. You know, you can't. You could only get bigger and bigger audiences. You couldn't hear it. And you, and we what with all the better. rifles and the big masks and all that and the clubs <laughs> frightened me to death, viewers. <laughs> oh, I hate to get Did on you politics, know? but uh, oh, you know yeah. you're you're a young man, about my age over there, right? And uh, what do you think about this uh, racial business over in England? I know we talked about well, this before. Seriously, well, the one over in England, or you know, the uh, the leader of the party uh, talking about uh, laws against immigration and uh, yeah, oh, you know, they just try to be with it. Thing. What do you mean by be with it? Just uh, well, like the Queen doesn't need to be with it, says Hardy Amit. She is it, says Hardy Amos. Now, the, that, that thing's just the same question everywhere, you know. There's no different in England. It's a bit less harmful in England. But it's the same thing, you know. Some people don't like other people because they're not the same as them. I talked to you after the, uh, about a year after the assassination of President Kennedy, and you said that at the time that this alarmed you, you know, it was a shocking thing when you first heard about it. Yeah. Did you feel the same thing? Assassination is... Of the same type of feeling moment. about Martin Luther King. Sure. Uh, yeah. What well, do you think we are, deadbeats? <laughs> I mean, well, what was your general, uh, the well, general I mean, reaction? What the was yours, then? I can't describe it. I said, oh, they've got another fellow, have they? They've done it again. Who is it? You know. Mm. Of course, you're separated from the scene. You're over there and you're looking, you're outside looking in. Uh, no, not really, you know. No, that's not We're true. trying to keep up with what's going on, Larry. It's the same thing everywhere, you know. There's somebody messing it up. And we're going to find him. <laughs> I believe his, uh, his description is going round now, at this very moment. Right. A short brown suit with a pair of charcoal grey trousers. You're keeping up with the times. Oh, I am, yes. One uh, final question. Uh, in oh. all the time you've been Beatles, before you were just people from Liverpool, uh, <laughs> There was always a question that somebody asked you, well, when's gonna, the bubble going to burst? Remember that? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, the bubble hasn't burst, mm. and it doesn't seem like it's going to burst. It just flew off. But do you ever envision a time of uh, just ceasing being the Beatles and going off on your own, or even working together? Mm. Just we are thing, We the do Beatles. work on our own anyway now. You never can be anything else we than the Beatles. We are the Beatles, and that's what we are. We're also Apple as well, see. They're yeah, like I mean, uh, Dr. Jekyll and Mrs. Brown. <laughs> But they're them. both meant to be nice, you see. Uh, do you plan a visit over here again? For uh... Oh, yeah. You know, we don't plan anything. It just happens, you know. We just come over here and go over there. And it's, uh, you know, we'll be back and, we, you know, anything could happen. Out of all your experiences in the United States, what would you say was the highlight of your career here? Escaping from Memphis. <laughs> <laughs> uh, seriously, Just the first, the first thing happening. Just hearing about I want to hold your hand in Paris, I remember it so well. We had a celebration milk, and when we got here and all that scene was going on at the airport, it was amazing, that was it. Did I you think. expect this? That's what happened. Yeah, that's what happened. Did you expect it? No, 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 man. No. It was just sort of getting a foothold in the market, but not getting your whole head right in straight away. Mm -hmm. What do you think about music now, here in this country, our top 40? Nielsen for president. Do you think music is making it? Do you think it's improved any? Do you think some of it? There's a lot of sort of. It goes up and down, you know. Well, we got Bill Haley again. And we've also got what came before him. That's young girl, get out of the way. <laughs> I guess that's about it. But I'd like to uh, extend my best wishes to both of you. And, uh, it's I been a pleasure. I don't know if it's going to help. Great working with you, Larry. Uh, yes, it is. Enjoyed it. Mm. And you can join Apple anytime you like. <laughs> okay.